Typical uh, Big 12 game, and uh, uh, it's a blessing to play in arenas like this. It's a blessing to play in the Big 12. Um, wins feel so good. Losses hurt so much. Um, but uh, at the end of the day, we got a culture of joy. Jesus, others, yourself. Nobody uh, got hurt on our team, a couple cramps, uh, whatnot. But uh, I was proud of our effort. We gave ourselves a chance to win on the road. Uh, credit uh, K-State for making uh, the plays down the stretch. And uh, they did, we didn't, so uh, uh, they got the dub. And Scott, uh, five of 28 from three, did you feel like that was something K-State was really doing, an off shooting night combination, what was happening? Kind of on no, that I, I, I think you got to credit their length. Um, they got NBA length and that affects our shooters. Um, at the same time, uh, um, as the game went on, I thought we had better and better looks. I thought early on I didn't like our looks as much and that's on me as a coach. Took too many contested twos and rushed threes and as the game went on, I thought we had, we had a lot better looks. And Langston, you go three of seven, but the rest of the team uh, goes, I think, two of 21 from three. Did it feel like you all were playing a little bit tighter as the shots weren't going in, or how did it feel in overtime? Uh, you know, I, I just want to give thanks to God just for us giving, letting, allowing us just this opportunity to even be here and play K-State. You know, we didn't come out with what we want, but we're still blessed, you know. And, you know, shots down the stretch, we weren't playing tight. We were just playing basketball. We all believe in ourselves. We all work hard. We're in the gym every day. So the shots just didn't fall tonight, and we just need to get back in the gym and keep working. And Scott, it looked like at the end of the game, you got open threes in both the end of regulation and the end of overtime. Were those the two shots you were looking for in those sequences? Yeah, you can't get better shots to win games. Uh, and the best shooters in the country are going to make four out of 10 or five out of 10. So we got to get the offensive rebound. I think I think he's a really good coach. So he puts him in position to win. Um, and then I think uh, uh, the home games, that's why it's so hard to win on the road in the Big 12. So uh, uh, the fans deserve a lot of credit for that, like when, when home teams win. Um, but I, I credit him. He's a really good coach. And, and I guess one more, Matt, if that's okay. Scott, uh, you all did grab 23 offensive rebounds tonight. What was going well for you on the offensive glass? Yeah, we were grabbing them. We just didn't get enough second chance points. Anything else? Any thoughts on Arthur Camula, number uh, 24? Yeah, um, I thought uh, uh, double double. Um, uh, he's improving defensively. We played him last year in the NCAA tournament, and uh, I know uh, there's a lot of things he, he he does that maybe doesn't show up in the in the stat sheet. So um, uh, he's definitely progressing. So he must be working hard, and they're doing a good job coaching him. Good. Thank you guys.